That old early morning sun's about to break on the horizon. The coffee's a perkin, <laughs> and the bacon's a cooking, and it's time once again to head on up to Sportsman's Lodge and visit with Ron Jones. We don't try to kill anything but roosters. Oh, you know? yeah. Number one again, we are the best outdoor show in the Tri-States, and we certainly do appreciate you watching this program and doing business with our sponsors, because that's what makes us number one, and we're just so proud of that. And uh, I tell you what, it's, uh, it's, it's a wonderful thing. I want to remind you also to watch our Down Home in the Tri-States show. It comes on before this show. It's uh, called Down Home in the Tri-States. It comes on at 5.30 on WMBB, and then Sportsman's Lodge comes on at 6 right after this. So I want to, want to invite you to watch both of them, and we certainly do appreciate you uh, watching this program and doing with our sponsors. That's why we're able to do it, because of you and our advertisers, okay? Got some loyal advertisers out there. We certainly appreciate it. <clears throat> oh, I'm going to say hello to somebody real quick. I want to say hello to Mr. Bruce Hall over in Scotts Ferry. Ran into him the other day. Old Calvin Cream and myself was over there doing a show. We're going to be showing that in a, a couple of weeks. And ran into Bruce Hall, and he lives over at Scotts Ferry. Lives on Chipotle River over there. He he said, you call me sometime. I'll show you where they at over here. So I said, I wish I'd have known that before we came. But old Calvin and I, we had a good time. Boy, we worked hard for the few fish we caught, but we had a wonderful time. Also want to say hello to Mr. Ray and Burnham and Kathy, his wife. Ray's been under the weather a little bit. You know, Ray's the, the, the boy peanut man over there on Highway 231 and Highway 20. Been there for years on that corner right there. But Ray, been under the weather a little bit. So I want to say, uh, hope you get better, Ray. And he's, he's, he's been in health south for a while, but I think he's out and then doing okay. Want to remind you also about the big 4th of July celebration going on at Holiday on Wheels of Panama City. That's on uh, West 23rd Street. You need to go by there and see David. Meadows and Diane Meadows and the whole staff down there. They have got some of the best prices on RVs that you're going to find anywhere. They're going to have the best prices on parts. They're going to have hard to find parts that you can't find anywhere else for RVs and motorhomes and pop-ups and all that. So you need to go out there and see them. Tell them Ron Jones sent you from Sportsman's Lodge and down home in the Tri-States and we certainly would appreciate it. And uh, you're going to get your best deal at Holiday on Wheels. I can't say anything else. A bunch of wonderful, nice folks down there. They're very loyal to this program like all our advertisers are. And we certainly do appreciate it. That's the big 4th of July celebration going on. They're combining that with their 35th birthday celebration. So it's a big, big bang blowout. They're cracking prices and, and everything. So y'all be sure to get my holiday on wheels. Now, it's that time again. It's watermelon time. And so what, what does these watermelons have in common with this? Nothing. That's what you're going to get at most of these places you go to buy watermelons. Mr. Paul Davidson, Mr. Billy Brock, they grew these watermelons themselves. Folks, these, I can't hardly pick them up, they're so big. But for what you're gonna pay for these, you're gonna pay for the same thing for this little old watermelon like this, you're gonna get it most places. You don't want that, you want some good quality watermelons. And we're fixing to cut them open and show you, just like we did last year and every year, they always have quality watermelons. So y'all watch this. All right, y'all watching? I want to show you, this is gonna blow you away. Let me get my stuff out of the way. These things are so pretty and red and juicy. and. Uh, uh, just like last year, when you see this, you're going to run down there and get you one. Now, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to take the first five callers, and if I don't answer the phone, uh, just just, just uh, leave your, your name and your phone number so I can call you back. But the first five people that call the number on the screen there, you're going to get a free watermelon from uh, Main Street Market in, in uh, Chipley, Florida. That's in corner Highway 77, Highway 90. So call me. If I don't answer the phone, leave me a message because I'm going to take the first five callers as they come in, okay? And you're going to get you a free watermelon. Look here now. I want to show you something. Insert knife. Pull that thing down a little bit. I want to show you, folks. This is going to blow you away now. I want you to watch this. I want to show you how pretty these things are. And they're all like this. But you look at him. Look at this right here. I'm going to roll that one over just a little bit. Come on here now. Here we go. Here we go. I didn't cut it quite far enough. Look at there. What you talking about? Man. Son, these are, these. look how pretty these things are. Just as pretty and red. But let's get this one over here. Let's cut this thing open right here. We have two different kind of watermelons here. And they got both of them up there. 
they both good though. Some people like them with the stripes on them. I forgot what he said the names of these things. We're going to be doing an interview with them uh, on Down Home in the Tri-States next week. Y'all want to be sure and see that with him and Mr. Billy Brock. So here we go now. Look at this thing right here. Come on, get on there. I need to give me a sharper knife what I need to do. All right, here we go. Bust this thing open. Here we go. Boom, come on in here. Look at that. Goodness gracious. Goodness gracious, what you talking about? Man, folks, don't pay high prices for them little old bitty watermelons. Go to Main Street Market, get you one of these big old juicy fat boys. I'm telling you what, you know, don't throw your money away. Go to Main Street Market. They be, tell them Ron Jones sent you from Sportsman's Lodge and down home in the Tri-States, and uh, they'll treat you right, I guarantee it. You're going to find these folks at Main Street Market on the corner of Highway 77 and Highway 90 in Chipley, Florida. Folks, don't throw your money away on them little bitty watermelons. Go up there, tell Paul Davidson we sent you. While you're there, stock up on some squash, some frozen vegetables, fresh shell peas and butter beans, uh, potatoes. They got everything up there. Got a, a one room devoted to Amish food, all kind of Amish stuff. Got uh, good or cheesy creamery milk, butter. Go on up there and I'll tell you what, I'm fixing to dig into this thing right here. Man, what you talking about? Mmm, mmm. Mmm. Folks, you ain't gonna find no better watermelon than this right here. I don't care where you go. Mmm, 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 mmm. When buying meat, make sure it's fresh and that you know where it came from. Stone's Meats in Chipley, Florida is the butcher of choice in this area. Everything is made right here. We produce our own bacon, hams, and sausage. From smoked bacon, hams, and sausage, to fresh cut beef and pork, Henry Stone and his staff know the business. Henry can custom cut. If you like your steak three quarters of an inch or an inch and a half, we'll cut them however you like them. Folks, don't take any chances. Buy it fresh cut from the best. Stone's Meats, 1008 Highway 277, Shipley, Florida. 850-638-0673. Be safe. Call Stone's Meats today. We've said it for years, folks. When you do business with Stone's Meats in Chipley, Florida, you know where your meat's coming from and you know that it's safe. Have you got water problems? Pump won't pump. Do you need answers and solutions, but you don't want the runaround and you want someone honest? Well, have no fear, folks. Do what I did. Call the man, Water Dan. Dan Dubosel, take care of your problems. Hello, folks. This is Water Dan. I work on submersible pumps, jet pumps, do repairs and upgrades, anything to do with an existing water well. I would appreciate it if you call. Call the man, Water Dan. He'll take care of your water problems. 850-535-9308. 535-9308. Folks, you know why people from Washington, Jackson, Holmes, Bay County, you know why they call Water Dan? Because Dan Dubos knows what he's doing. Y'all give him a call. AMH Automotive has moved to a bigger and better location to better serve more customers. 5213 East Business Highway 98. Come let Mike do it. Y'all come see me at my new location. From little cars to big trucks or anything in between, we can take care of your automotive needs. All minor and major repairs from brakes to overheating for head gaskets, let Mike do it. Give us a call. We might be able to solve your problem on the phone. If you don't know where to take your vehicle to get the job done, take it to Mike. Now located at 5213 East Business Highway 98, just west of Mr. Bingo. Come let Mike do it. Locked out of your car? Call Mike. He'll get you back on the road.
called Panama City. Panama City Beach is the place I want to be. Panama City. Panama City Beach. We're gonna have a good time. Panama City Beach. Lots of fun for you and me. Panama City. The time is right. You can't go wrong. going in the Gulf of Mexico today, folks, and uh, we got some experts on this boat today. They invited me to go, and I said, man, anytime I go as an expert, I want to go. So we're fixing to get ready to go, and uh, uh, we're going to have some real nice day today, and seas are nice. So very little wind. Hope it stays that way. Sun's good. We're going to be hot, but that's okay. So I'm going to introduce you to these folks, okay? All right, we got Joe Riley on the left here. And who in my guy in the middle here? Travis. Travis. Frank Bottoms. Frank Bottoms. Now, when Joe called me, he said, look, he said, I got one guy that's going with his name, Travis. He said, now, Travis, when Travis goes, you can bet your bottom dollar you're going to load the fish in the, in the cooler. So, uh, I ain't putting you on the spot or anything, Travis, but it's all up to you. <laughs> okay? All right. Y'all ready to go? Let's Let's hit the seas, boys. We'll be spending two hours trying to catch them both, Jeff. Going to anchor? We're going to anchor. That must mean something good. Wow, this snow sure is gritty and salty. No, 
snow, silly. This is sand, not snow. So that's why it's so hot. Yeah, but thank goodness our daddy owns A-plus air conditioning. He keeps our home as cold as Alaska. Cool. Hey, I'll race you home. For the most professional, most reliable, and most preferred air conditioning service in the area, call A-plus air conditioning, 850-230-3009. Okay, bet you I can win. When you have work to do, get it done with a Kubota. Kubota is the top choice for reliability, efficiency, and value. And right now, during Kubota Rewards, take advantage of zero down and 0% APR for up to 60 months on new Kubota utility and ag tractors, tractor loader backhoes, and utility vehicles. It pays to own orange. See your Kubota dealer today. See and save on all Kubota tractors and equipment at Soul Tractor today. King's Outdoors has been serving the hunters and fishermen in this area for many, many years. Come see them at their new location, now with a more extensive line. At King's, we feature for the bass fisher, the carrot stick rods, skeet reefs rods, Garcia, Vengeance and Vendetta rods, all with a replacement warranty. At King's, we feature the plastic baits that you want, from culprit to zoom. You'll find what you need in the hook line, from mullet snatch hooks to true turn for the pan fisher. The brim fisher, we feature year-round, Little Jewel, Red Holland, and Brim Buster brim poles. At King's, we'll work hard to earn your business and keep your business. Come see us. Ron, you should be sick to get wet. That's what I want. No. <laughs> don't, don't fall in. Don't get your booty switch. He was up there messing with anchor and just fell right in. All right, that's it. Well, he's red anyway. What right? you got, Frank? One of the elusive red snappers. Yeah. He comes up at almost touching the 18. Throw him back. No way. <laughs> we got a place for him up front here. One, <laughs> one more and you can go to the house. <laughs> this ain't going to work. Sit right there. Yeah, man. Look at that. Frank, Travis, Travis never likes to catch the first one. He always likes to go ahead and get, let somebody else get in and he gets the second one. That's right. You having trouble there, Travis? Frank, just have a reason. Make it go. All right. Where's the gloves? There you go, red sniper. All right. I don't want to get going to measure, but that's a good red sniper. We're going to see. All right. You're going to get one of them groupers that likes them pinfish without a tail. That's right. That's some big ones that like those. Captain putting on one of those pinfish? Yeah, he, he thought he saw a grouper down there, so he's going <laughs> to. Hang on, hang on.
Yeah. That's why the fish ain't biting. It's the next best thing to the old vegetable truck. It's Main Street Market in Chipley. Owned and operated by Paul Davidson, Main Street Market stocks the largest selection of good fresh fruits and vegetables and a whole lot more. We sell wholesale or retail. From fresh local milk. That's so cheesy creamery milk. To a complete line of Amish products to livestock and pet food. We now offer a full line of Seminole feed. We also carry a full line of frozen vegetables. All types of Amish cheese. We have Amish butter. That's one of our specialties. Hey, you need it? We've got it. Top quality coastal Bermuda horse hay year round. Main Street Market. We're located on the corner of Highway 90 and 77 in Chipley, Florida. Innovative Glass. Together, Mark Moody and Tim Johnson have over two decades of experience in the glass industry. Mark and Tim have made Innovative Glass a success story. Innovative Glass has the most up-to-date equipment that you won't find at a lot of other glass companies in the area. They specialize in residential and commercial. Anything from shower doors, tabletop glass, and special made-to-fit windows and doors, Innovative Glass can handle small and large jobs, including big condo development window and door replacements. Innovative Glass has has Sportsman's Lodge stamp of approval. Give them a call. It's 850-541-2417 and 850-541-2418. Innovative Glass, the professionals in Bay County. Innovative Glass, the original go-to glass company for this area, for honesty, dependability, quality. Tim and Mark at Innovative Glass have been in this business. They know what customers like and they know quality. Innovative Glass is your original best go-to glass company. Go see Innovative Glass. Give them a call. Tell them Ron Jones sent you. We certainly would appreciate it. Holiday on Wheels of Panama City is celebrating our birthday with America's birthday. We're popping deals and cracking prices. Firecracker specials on America's best RVs. Let freedom ring as you enjoy the great outdoors in a new motorhome, travel trailer, fifth wheel, or one of our popular pop-up campers. All American savings throughout the largest RV parts department in the area with good selection of hard-to-find parts. America is beautiful and so are our prices. If you want to find out how freedom feels, come to Holiday on Ed Holly, Holly Outdoors, Bluntstown, Florida, where we sell the most dependable outboard on the market, Tahatsu. Two and a half horsepower to 115, Tahatsu has an engine to meet your needs. And Tahatsu still builds and sells two stroke engines. Tahatsu Outboards from Holly Outdoors in Bluntstown, Florida, 850 674 7718. 850 674 7718. What you got, Ron? It's a sign. I mean, it's a good sign. Yeah. It ain't big enough, but it's a good sign. That's a little old red snapper. Look to be about 16 inches long. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's my first one of the day. <laughs> yeah. You, you all right? I got you now. All right. <laughs> well, you shut it off because I know you're ready to fish. <laughs> Let's go kill. You got to get one bigger than that now. He's pretty though. Hold him up, Frank. Yeah, okay. Good looking fish. Yeah, man. people love to look at him. Oh, yeah. I guess we can see him for the sun. That's right. Didn't catch him on the other side next time. Take a look at him. If we videoed only the ones that was legal, we wouldn't have but eight fish <laughs> to, show on, to show on the show, you know? How well, about we, that? We like to look at them whether they're legal or not. That's right. That's right, yeah. Let's see. Nice. That is legal there. Caught in on a on a chauffeur, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. A little combo meal for him. Yeah. Get my 
fish on camera. What you truck. got, Ron? I don't know. He's, he's 17 inches, I think. He hit that chauffeur, boy. <laughs> what the poop? Come on, he's taking his head. Is he? I see. I like it. You bring him up here and have a little bit. Yeah, that's a little group of foot. Yeah. Well, we got a gag. Yeah. Look at there. Good job, Ron. Yeah, man. <laughs> a little bit bigger, we keep it. Hang that on. Hold him up. There you go, Ron. What'd you catch him on? Got him on a chauffeur. There I'm you gonna, go. I'm gonna measure him just to see how big he is. So some people will know. Okay. Out there and they think, oh, that's big enough. Yeah. We're gonna look and just see how big he is. He's about 20 inches even. There you go. What does he have to be? Bigger than that. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Got a snapper coming up. Sure do. He might be legal. That's pretty good in there. That might be legal. That's a nice snapper. That's pretty now, good. Now, I was telling you something about squirrel fish, people call them. Uh -huh. The name is, it's, it's at, the technical name is sand perch. Sand perch. You, you've caught them before. They make yeah. good grouper bait, but mm -hmm. if, you, if, if you've never done it, if you'll take those things home, mm -hmm. okay, and you cook them like a brim or whatever, or you can flay them if they're big enough. Cook them and eat them. They're good. Oh, they, have you eaten them before? Uh -huh. Oh, they are fantastic. They're, they're real good. They're white really good. meat. Oh, what? Very white. Yeah. It looks green when you clean them, but it's white. Yeah. It's white meat. Mm -hmm. I love it. I like snapper too. Half pound. You got a thing on there? Yeah. Dude, let's see. Yeah. Oh, no, no, you sure do. Three and a half pounds. It can eat. Well, it can either be the legal limit or three and a half pounds. Whichever one comes first. That's right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. Good fish. What you got, Ron? Another little old snapper. They almost like beeliner. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I guess it's something to grow up, ain't it? That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Good <laughs> job. Help make the show, you know? That's right. Oh, Ronnie, come in. He's snapping. Oh, he's a, he's a legal snapper, I believe. No, not quite. Pretty there. That's perfect. They're all pretty today. Just pretty as they can be. They look a lot better in the cooler, don't they? They do. 